Hey everyone, it's Marie and me, Hayden. Welcome back to my channel. If you haven't already, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share, do all the things. Today we are making a light up card. You want to show me your card? So here's the card that Hayden made with some help and show them how it lights up. Hold it here. Ah, so cool, right? How did we do that? We used a circuit, so when you press on this blue um, canvas thing, it lights up the explosion. Yeah. For it. It's a circuit. Yeah, so Hayden's been learning about circuits, and I told him that sometimes for light up cards, I use circuits. And wasn't that so cool? Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna kind of show you how we put the circuit together for this card. Now Hayden helped color the little guy here and color all the things. Um, I helped him make just a really quick background. And then most of this video is just going to be showing how you make a circuit. And Hayden's going to explain some circuitry to us. Well, let's go ahead and show people how we made a light up card. Yeah. Okay? All right. So we're going to build our circuit. We already have our background done, and Hayden has created our little pieces here. We stamped and colored them and cut yeah. them out. We're gonna make this little chemist make an explosion. Okay? Light up fun. Yeah, light, lots of fun, light up fun. So we're gonna kind of um, think about how we wanna put our card, where our pieces are gonna go. Um, we kind of talked about it beforehand. And what do you want to light up? The explosion. The explosion, okay. And where do we want our button? Um, it in so we're going to push this and that's going to light up. Yeah. Okay. So we need to kind of glue down our pieces then. So that they stay... But we need to poke like a little hole in here so that the light. We can... will. But I'm going to. We're going to glue it down together first. Um, and then we'll poke a hole. Then. What is he doing with his explosion? Well, you see, he just doesn't know what. What he's. What chemist stuff. He's doing with it, mm -hmm. so he'll just mix up different chemicals. He doesn't know if it'll explode or not. Mm. So, so he doesn't really know what he's doing. He's just mixing chemicals together. Yeah. Oh my! Isn't that dangerous? He, mm, kind of. Yeah. Are there some chemicals that can make a reaction? Well, you see, he really makes. A lot of explosions. Okay. Like uh, on all the Mondays, Tuesdays, Fridays. Monday, Tuesday, and Fridays are explosion days, huh? Well, well he just mixes it up like okay, Canada. Oh. That makes no explosion. But on all the other days, it'll explode. Oh. So Monday, Tuesday, Friday. So that means Wednesday and Thursdays are his explosion days. Yeah. Oh, okay. 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 So now we're going to poke a hole in here. Yeah. And so that our light can shine through. Yeah. And but it needs to be a bigger hole. Well, I think we'll poke, well, we'll poke a few holes back here. And so it'll look like, oh, that one's bigger. But you know what? We're just, we're doing this mainly to learn about our circuits, right? So it doesn't have to be. Perfect, right? Yeah. Okay, so what we want to do is we want to mark where we want our light. So I'm just going to make some little dots so we know our light needs to go there. And our um, battery button needs to go about here, okay? So we're going to build our circuit. On That's big. Yeah, we're going to build our circuit. Now, Hayden, what's a circuit? A circuit is a... Thing where electricity flows 
through to get and light up the light bulb. Right. Now Thomas Edison was the first guy to ever invite the light, invent the light bulb. Okay. So um, and circuits are mostly just flowing from the battery to the thing it's powering up back to the battery. Mm -hmm. Now when like lights and switches in your walls that turn on the fan and stuff. Yes. Well, when you turn on the switch, it connects the circuit. When you turn it off, it disconnects the circuit so electricity can't flow through. And if it's supposed to go, then we're, then, um, we'll actually need to be connected. So if it, the circuit breaks, and it can't work. Oh, yeah. So that's Dun. some facts about a real light bulb. Good job. Dun. That's what we're doing. Tommy. Okay, so you see what I'm doing here? Yeah. I'm putting some adhesive on the back of our little button. Can I snap that on? Yep, we want it to go just about here. So go ahead and push it down. All right. I can't believe I'm helping. I know, it's so fun. Okay, and then this is going to go right over here when we're all done. And we can test it out. I can feel that button. Pushing right can here. I feel? Yep. See, that's where our button's gonna go. We're gonna leave this piece of plastic in. Do you know why? Why? Because this is the battery. And when I pull that out, it's going to connect with this metal plate and it's gonna be able to flow the electricity through the positive and negative side. Okay? Okay. So, what do you think we have to do now? Um, make this. Um, like this thing that goes from here all the back, way back to here. Yeah, we have to make our circuit. Yay! We're going to do that with our... Tape. Copper tape. Do you know why we're using copper? Um, because copper can let electricity flow. Right. Copper can have electricity flow through it. Yeah! So, let's try this. Let's peel it back a little bit. So this is just some tape, which is copper. It's sticky on the back. So let's go ahead and try to stick it down and build our circuit. We want it to connect to each of these sides. So we're gonna connect it to positive. I want to help. Yep. And then we can tear it easily when we need to change directions. And so we wanna make sure that our circuit is all connected. You want all of the parts to connect. Yep, so why don't you help push that down onto the paper up here, because we know that's where our little light is gonna go, okay? We're also gonna tear that off. Easy for you, because you have the like, nails. I have nails, right? Uh, strong and rippy. Yeah. Um, we have a light here. And that's small. It's tiny in the middle, that's the light. The W it. means it's a white color. We also have yellow. Oh, uh, red! We can do red, but I'm just explaining to you. Do you see the tiny little plus and minus on there? Let me see. Okay. I can't see it. I'll, I'll show you. There's a tiny little plus and minus on the light. I can't see. Do you see that tiny little plus and minus? Oh, yeah! What side, plus or minus, what side do you think we will connect to um, this? Plus. Right, the this plus. This side, the minus. Right. So you wanted a red. Yeah. So we're going to find a red light. This one has a little R on it. So it's red. And it's already sticky on the back. So why don't you go ahead and connect the plus side right onto that tape. Actually, before we do that, let's get our minus side or negative side going, okay? That way we can put the light on both of them. All right, so. It's bluey. Yep, it's got to focus. We had a little trouble with our light. It wasn't lighting up. So we made some adjustments. We put the light on top of the tape. I think that seems to work better than putting the tape on top of the light. Yeah, and so then let's show them what it looks like, bud. See? I'm going to. Make it darker. See that red light lighting up? Hayden shows red. And then, let's put that over it. It looks like it's an explosion. 
bait. Uh -huh. Okay, so now we want to line this up. Make sure all the tape is clear. We're not connecting any of the tape with the circuit. And go down. Yeah. Stick it. And there is the card. Our light up card. Can I see? Yeah, absolutely. That is pretty cool, man. Can here, let's I put see? it down here. I'm gonna put my hands around, make it dark, and you light it up. Whoa! That is building a circuit and making a light up card. Isn't that cool? Yeah. All right. Thomas Edison make a light bulb, a light bulb. which lit, lit up. Yes. He tried and tried and tried, but soon he got it. So you can keep trying to make what your car design is oh. and your light, and then I'm sure you will get it just like Thomas Edison. Sometimes things don't happen the first time, right? Yes. Right. Sometimes you have to fail a few times before you get what you want. Right? Right. Right. Just like Thomas Edison. He did the light bulb, right? right. Light bulbs use circuits. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Okay. <laughs>